yo what is up guys and welcome back to another video today i'm going to be showing you how to start your own ogsm project which is og fortnite and this is how you get it so go to the first link in the description which will bring you to the ogf fin hub uh discord server then what you want to do is go to build channel and then as you can see this is mine i'm going to be adding seven six five and four builds for chapter one and then you want to find your build that you want to download it can be any of these you click it click continue to download sometimes it'll bring you to a website like this and you click download and then it should start download it'll take a little while depending on your internet speed and then while that's downloading or when it's done downloading you can go back to discord and go to the ogsn hub go to the back end channel and you could either use the whole v2 back end or momentum back end i would recommend momentum it's way better it's low end server, which is a low end server, but better. It has all this stuff. Plus more. What you want to do is click code. Excuse me. Download zip. Okay, let me pause this real quick. <laughs> okay, once it's done, you want to open it. You want to drag it onto your desktop. Wait, you want to drag it onto your desktop just like. Gosh damn it. You want to drag it on your desktop just like this. And then. Uh, should be on your desktop. You want to open that folder. Then what you want to do is you can like make this a little bigger. Oh shoot. Uh, you want to make this a little bigger if you want to. Just like that. You, what you want to do is you want to find the dot env dot example. And example, you want to remove the dot example. You want to click enter, and then click yes. Then what you want to do is you want to open this, and then you want to go to the sec the second link in the description. And it will take you to discord.dev, which is Discord Developer Portal. And then you want to click New Application. Agree. Name it. Suit. And then it's going to... Do that. Once you do that, it will bring you here what you want to do from there is you want to go to bot find the um reset token button click yes do it and do not share your token with anybody i'll be right back i gotta get a two-step verification code be right back three two one b r b Okay, never mind. There's no pause button for some reason. Well, I will just. Yeah, let me just put it in. I don't even care. <laughs> First video, so yeah. So I'm said, welcome to another video, but still. Thank you guys for supporting me. To 160 subs. Thank you guys so much. I'm on my phone right now, trying to get this code. I'm gonna keep on typing in the wrong password. There we go. Okay. I'm looking at my code. If you have two SA, it will ask you to do this, but if you don't, it will not. Boom. Just like that, you want to, you, if you see my token, I will be deleting this right after. So, don't worry about trying to steal it. Copy. You can go out of here. Go back to this, uh, notepad. If it asks you what you want to open up with, click notepad. And then you want to click where it says bot token right here. You want to click through the parentheses and you want to paste then you want to add like a name i'll just say two and then what you want to do is go to the third link in the description and type in i mean it will bring you to radman vpn and then you click free download the big blue button click save wait for it to install so I've already installed this, so it's um, I can't do the process again. So just like run the installer crap, and then once it's done, you may search this and then click that. Then you want to. So then what you do is you right click on the IP, 
click copy and then click network create network and name it something random like anything you want oh shoot wait There we go, should be there. Right click it, copy. And what you wanna go is to game servers right here. You wanna click here and you want to paste. Then what you wanna do, if you want the squads, you can do it there, I'm just gonna leave that default. Then what you do is you come down here where it says matchmaker IP, delete one of these S's and then repaste this just like that. And then, Make sure allow reboot is on and make your season whatever your main season is that you're gonna launch. Make sure this is 3551 for the sake of this tutorial. Um then what that's pretty much and, and then what you want to do is go to the uh I lost count of the links. Uh 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 fourth link, my bad. I lost freaking count. Oh shoot, what the crap? If you want to go to this fourth link and it should be it should bring you to it should bring you to this link right here the community server right here once you get here you want to click download make sure this is all this and make sure you have a 64 bit once it's installed just uh run it it should make an installer just finish the installer once the installer is done just um uh, what's it called? Once the installer's done, it may take a little while because it's a DB. Once it's done, you want to open it. Oh, shoot. You want to open it just like this. You want to click add new connection. You want to go back to this. You want to copy this link right here. You want to go here and you want to paste it and then click save and connect. And it should connect. If you have any troubles with um, this, just join the Discord server and go to general and ask for help and the OGFN help, help. Once you get finished with all this, just click Control S or click File and Save. Then you can get all that out. Then what you want to do is you want to go to install packages.bat. Oh, and go to the fifth link in the description. I forgot about this. And install uh, Node that js and you want to go to this it should pop up here is what the fifth link should be you want to save this and you want to run the uh installer just like normal and then open the install dot bat if you if i'm going too fast guys just pause the video I'm sorry if i'm going too fast then you want to click run gonna install the no modules, which is helps it run. Then don't close it out, just wait for it to close itself. There we go. Then what you want to do is you want to click run, and you got to open the start.bat. If you have any problems, like I said before, go to the OGFN hub and go to general and just ask for help. We can see, as I see here, I'm already it's already in use. That's an easy fix. Go to your task manager. Go here. Type in node. And just end the task. And then you can start it again. And just like that. Once it says everything's running, you should be good. Then go back to the discord.dev website. Go to OAuth2. Then you want to scroll down and click bot, administrator, scroll down some more, copy this, open a new tab, go here, and then you add it to a server. I'm just going to add it to something like this server, random off server, <laughs> and just wait, and then once it's in, it should say it's playing momentum if you haven't changed it already, and it should be online. Then what you want to do is you want to do slash register. Type in the username you want your name to be in game. I'm just going to say toot email toot at gmail.com. Copy that. And then your password toot toot toot. 
two, 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 two. Oh, I just got copy of that. So let's see it again. Okay, and then you want to add a one. I guess <laughs> you click enter. You're already registered. That means I'm already in the DB, so I'm gonna do slash create. It shouldn't do that for you. Uh, it's just normal for me because wait. I should delete count. Uh, okay. Uh, let me just try this one more time. Okay, now it shows they successfully created an account. Then what you want to do is you want to go to, uh, I think it's in the OGFN hub. Uh, launcher you can use this if you want uh but i'm not going to use it for this tutorial because it's too much setting up so you want to go to the sixth link in the description holy cow and you want it should take you to reboot launcher right here it should take you to this then what you to do is go to releases right here and download the latest one by clicking this and then running it like a normal setup then just open it by doing this then it should bring you here what you want to do is by your you want to add your email that you register with and then you want to add the password that you register by and do that then you want to go to the local in the backend tab make sure it's 3501 check backend if it says it worked correctly it's perfect then what you want to do is make sure it's the same here And then you can click start hosting and play. And make sure, wait, I'm stupid. <laughs> One second. Make sure you go here to the Fortnite version, add version, uh, this PC, select a version that you're using, and then click here and find that version. Make sure you're on the 15.30, and then don't select any of these, click select. I already added it which right here only reason it's not me in the same thing because i already added it and brought to the build i'll click start hosting go to play click launch fortnite and just wait for you to get in and as i'm you see i'm going to turn on that because i do not like it just wait for it to launch it should wait if you don't you don't have deep logs on i didn't tell you to do that but still uh, yeah, if y'all want more tutorials like this, like and subscribe and comment down more. Comment down more. Just like M O R E. Should say connecting to momentum. Wait for it to load. I'll show you how to change all this and if you comment more and like and subscribe. I'll show you how to change everything to momentum. Connecting. Then you should be in lobby. Now you wait for this to pop up, and then it should pop up this terminal. If it loads, you can't change your skin, so you gotta be quick about it. Uh, you can turn on the late game, that works. If everything works, I'm gonna turn it off for this video. And what you wanna do is, for a 60% keyboard, under the exit, or for a 60% keyboard, you want to, for this, you will need a, just like a regular keyboard, not a 60%. And under the exit key, it should be like a, a little comma wavy thing. You want to click that, and it should pop up this debug thing at the bottom. You want to type in open. Click on ready. Okay, and if it does that, just click open. 127.0.0.1. And click enter. Ah, oh, my GS crashed. Crazy. <laughs> okay, so now we're just gonna wait. Crash. Let me make sure I have the default yet. Embedded yet. Yeah. Sometimes it may crash. It's pretty normal. It's, yeah. The mythic thing I'm working on the shop. As you can see right here, 
parking thing. And the momentum is the second. Okay, my game crashed. Well, most likely you just click enter whenever you have that thing in at the bottom. And then you click one cheer and you can click start bus on the console. And yeah, pretty much it. But if you need any help or this didn't make sense to you, just join the OGFN hub and ping me. I am unlisted user by going here at unlisted user help. I watched to it didn't work or something like that and explain and I will respond. And if I don't respond, just DM me. And yeah. Thank you for watching, guys. Please hit that like button and subscribe if you want more tutorials about this.